Hi, my name is Dan Weiss, and I'm the Product Manager of Labs for Microsoft Web. Today, I'd like to talk with you about how you can access and purchase Labs Online through Microsoft Web and Courseware Library. On Courseware Library, you can find overview information on Labs Online, including the benefits, reduced training costs, increased sales potential by enabling distance learning, and realize flexibility through having an on-demand service. You can also understand the pricing option of the Labs Online. You can request free coupons, and you can also browse the catalog. But before you can browse the catalog, one must log in. If not logged in, please go through the Join Now process. Any user who attempts to log in and purchase Labs Online will have to be approved by your CPLS admin to purchase on Courseware Library, or have to be the CPLS admin themselves. After logging in, you will have to enter a username and password. Upon logging in, on the right side, you will see the avail a list of available courses for Labs Online. And those will be classified by the same mock course number and then the last acronym LLL. If you do not see that option, you can browse by courseware type by clicking under Labs Online under courseware type and then clicking search below. And this will bring you back your list. Now, if you are looking at purchasing a course, it is exactly the same way you purchase other content on Courseware Library. Click on the course to find out more information. And you have clicked to add to cart. Currently, Labs Online are free due to open trial that we are offering in Microsoft Learning through the remainder of 2009. This will then take you to your cart, where you can add in the number of licenses that you want to have. You will need to have the equivalent number of licenses for the number of students that you're planning to teach in this course. I'm going to click Update Shopping Cart, and then I'm going to click Continue. And I'm going to, even though it says zero, I'm going to hit Pay with Credit Card. And now it's done. During the pilot, it will take up to 72 hours for your organization to be set up onto Learning Central. This starting in early February, users and organizations will be able to self-register on Learning Central. And once that process is complete, you'll be able to purchase content on Courseware Library and consume it on Learning Central in, in a matter of hours. In our next session, we'll be talking about registering on Learning Central and using the functionality that exists for CPLSs there.